am I on their mind? That's what you want to know. Today's collective tarot reading. Are you on their mind? Have they been thinking about you? How do they feel their current feelings towards you? At the moment, do they miss you? All of the things. Welcome back to Hope to Have a Daily. My name is Angie. I'm a tarot card reader from England. This tarot reading is between you, the universe and your intuition. It's completely up to you if you claim it or not. It is a timeless reading, so it's relevant from the moment you come into contact with it. Are you on their mind? I'm going to do a connection spread between you both. And I'll tell you everything I'm picking up and everything I'm feeling. I'm going to split the deck into four, four elements, four seasons. Most importantly for angels, offering us a circle of protection. So I can give and receive all of these messages with an open heart and an open mind. Down this side is you. Down this side is them. And down the middle is the connecting energy. They're thinking of you. They're resisting it, but they're thinking of you. There's someone that's been interfering a little bit with this connection. If you want to support the channel, put a like on the reading. It doesn't cost you anything, and it helps push the thumbnail in front of someone that's never seen it before. Private readings are available. We have the three of ones for you in the recent past. They had the hanged man. There's a reason that you've both been brought together. And we have the seven of coins reversed in the middle of you both. The both of you abandoned other things to start this connection. I don't know if it was relationship circumstances and um, goals that one of you or both of you were working towards. But it feels like the both of you had to uh, abandon a, a direction that you were going into to create something here. They had to make a sacrifice and you had to explore something new to make this happen. Um... You've got the magician at the moment, which is absolutely lovely. So you're trying to manifest, you're trying to create something. They've got the queen of wands reversed, which is someone else interfering. But we've got the temperance in the middle of you both. Are you on their mind? Yes, you are, absolutely. You're both very in sync with each other. It feels like you read them quite well. It feels like your intuition's right about them. It feels like you kind of, you just know, you just know things. You also know who the Queen of Wands reversed is, maybe male, maybe female, but they've got an opinion and they keep interfering. They think they're doing what's best, but they're not. They need to butt out. Um, there's something to do with work. Your person needs to work away with work. Um, I don't know if they've told you yet, but yeah, they're, they've they're going to be away for work and it feels like distance it feels like they're going to be sleeping in a different bed to their own bed and not someone else's bed but I don't know if it's a hotel or it's it's somewhere where they are to do with work um they're going to be sleeping there and they're going to be doing like just exhausting stuff it feels like long hours um I don't know if it's training or, or just part of like their work contract um, so there's that. You may, you, I think this is a repeating thing. I think this is part of their job. And you miss them when they're not around. You miss them because, of course, they can't communicate as much and, and they can't do that and this. And it does feel like this Queen of Wands reversed likes to play on, on that silence of, well, they don't like you anyway. Of course they like you. Um, it's just work. You know, um, if they didn't have to work, if they had all of the money in the world, they wouldn't be working and they'd be spending it all with you. Don't let this Queen of Wands reverse get in your head because they don't know what they're talking about. We've got the sun reversed moving forward, which is like them coming back in again. And then, you know, when they're working away, when they're not being able to communicate as much, they're hopeful. They can't wait to see you again. They're, they're like happiness and everything's on hold. They play over in their mind how it's going to go and what's going to happen. Um, you've got the hermit at that point. So you you feel the disconnect. You feel, oh, they're not here and we can't communicate. Now, in those moments, you can either have that trust that, yeah, they are working. Yeah, they are doing the things. And yeah, they do care about me. And yeah, they do miss me. Or you can go the way of overthinking and spiralling. The Queen of Wands reversed is then presenting themselves as the Empress reversed. This person would like the both of you to break up for whatever reason. There may be an ex of yours or theirs. Um, 
going to pull a nine card spread because I want to know, you know, can you both get into the real rhythm of one another? And because the more they work away and then they come back and it's happy again, the, you know, you'll learn, a tr you'll learn to trust that. Um, whereas if it's quite a new connection and they work away and you don't really hear from them, you don't know if they're going to come back. So the more, the longer you're together, the more confident you will feel about this connection and it feels like a nice connection it does feel like there's an ex that wants to interfere oh. they've got good intentions for themselves and they think that they've got good intentions for other people they don't at all <clears throat> just because they couldn't cope with someone working away doesn't mean that you can't so we've got the eight of emotions reversed we've got the six of inspiration reversed and then we've got the chariot so the better times are ahead of you both when you're not in each other's contact. You're both exploring each other really nicely. But then when they come back in again, when they get home from work, when they when they are able to, you know, unleash themselves, they're storming back in for you again. Um, I got the full reversed. They're reluctant to commit. The four of emotions reversed. They feel really down when they're working and the three of pentacles or the three of materials is all about the teams that they work in they're not having fun they're not having fun it's a grind it's a work it's it's this and that and they they do have this low energy and something that gets them through i'm seeing lots of water and like really poor communication but when they um when they can't communicate with you they feel sorry for themselves and part of them has been reluctant to fully commit because it's, they have to be sure that you're okay with with these periods of time when they're not around. So we've got the ten of materials, that's really nice. The eight of materials reversed and then the two of inspiration reversed. It really is work that gets in the way of, of doing nice things and... um. You just have to make the most of each other. It feels like building a life together. And it feels like once you get into the rhythm of things, and the really nice thing is in the nine card spread, this X hasn't turned up. So they're going to give up. I think once this person realises that you two are really serious, they're kind of just going to fade away, give up, stop putting their opinions in. So this is what I have for you. I hope it helps in some way. It feels like a really nice connection. Um, and they think about you all of the time in all of the ways. Lots of fantasy, lots of desire and passion and nice things. But also plans for the future as well. And plans when they're next going to see you. So I'm going to wrap you in a massive bubble of protection so your angels take you on your way. Thank you so much for being with me today. If you made it right to the end of the read and put a purple heart in the comments, hardly anyone makes it here. So you're really part of an elite crew. The affirmation for day, today is... I choose to be loved and I choose to love. Put that in the comments so I know that you made it right to the end of the reading and I will see you soon.